What's up everyone, Jonathan from Jopa Tech here, and I recently upgraded my LG Velvet to Android 12. Stay tuned to hear what's new, and if you are in the market for a Velvet, be sure to check out my other videos regarding this phone. Also, if you like my videos, please don't hesitate to subscribe to my channel and be sure to check out my other tech-related videos. Now, let's dive in. I want to mention first the new features brought on by Android 12. We now have a lockdown option in the power menu, which is great in case the 5 want to know everything about you. You also have the ability to toggle precise or approximate location permissions, again, in case the 5 want to know everything about you. As well, you can now remove permissions and free up space, access safety and emergency in the settings, and you now have control over microphone and camera usage, along with a little dot that lets you know you're being watched and listened to. These are all fine and dandy, and most people don't even care for some of these perks. But what is missing from the Android 12 update is Material U. Probably because LG isn't in the phone game and didn't want to waste time or resources on Material U and focus mainly on pushing Android 12 to the velvet. If Material U is something of interest, you may want to grab a different brand of phone running Android 12, like the Pixels. After the update, I wanted to play around with the phone and see how the overall performance is. Safe to say, gaming is still smooth and runs great, especially on that gorgeous P OLED display. RAM management has slightly improved in certain areas. In my review video of the LG Velvet, I mentioned how swiping up and holding to see your open apps would give me a stutter and sometimes freak out on me. To my surprise, I haven't experienced that so far in my day-to-day -day use. I think it happened once, but I also had multiple apps open to really push the phone to its memory limit. With only 6GB of RAM built in, expect to see reloads on demanding apps like games. Other than that, the LG Velvet with Android 12 is still a great option for a budget-priced phone in 2022. It is nice to see LG push out one more update well after they left the phone market, but don't expect to see Android 13. If you are in the market for an inexpensive phone with expandable storage, a beautiful screen, a nice booty, and a bloody headphone jack, the LG Velvet could be for you. With used prices ranging from $250 to $400 Canadian, you should be able to pick up a great condition Velvet and enjoy it for a few more years to come. For a more in-depth video on the Velvet, be sure to check out my review videos if you're interested in picking one of these up. Thanks for stopping by and don't forget to leave a like down below and be sure to comment your thoughts on the Velvet with Android 12 and let's get chatting. I'm Jonathan from Jopa Tech and I will see you all in the next video. Peace.